Hey guys, you asked for another Barbie movie reaction, and here it is. We're and delivering. Barbie Fairytopia! One of the best, one of the classics. 10 cc's of Barbie Fairytopia. Get it in there, get in there, get it in there, get it in there! Oh my god, the graphics. You know what it looks like? like it looks like, a, like an Ace of Cakes cake, <laughs> like fondant. <laughs> Everybody looks edible. Everything looks like fondant. Damn, just say you have a crush. <laughs> you have a crush on Prince and Bibble, Nalu? I see you. I'm trying to be like this this summer, me and the girls. What do you call a fairy without wings? I don't know. <gasps> Nothing. Who'd want to call a wingless fairy? That's yeah. hate speech. <laughs> Don't even bother, Bibble. If Bibble's ever annoying, could she just turn him into like a keychain or something? She takes him to Claire's and he gets like a grommet stuck through him. It's <laughs> a belly button piercing. <laughs> <laughs> what if Bi we find out Bibble's in his 40s? And he's, <laughs> you know what? He's hanging out with all these teenage, he's like the creepy co-worker who's like having slumber parties with the younger kids at work. Fraternizing. Dude, this is kind of dark academia. I want mold core. I want mold core house. Ooh, guys, new aesthetic. We're gonna create it. Spore core. Spore core. Beautiful, isn't it? Oh, wow. it's like opening my little brother's door. <laughs> Just like a fart chamber. When you like walk past your sibling's room, it smells like chorizo. The scent is so bad, it almost smells good. Like they've been kind of making onions and, and garlic yeah, together. Yeah, is that teriyaki flavor? Ooh. What do we, is it a beef jerky? You could sell your recipe to Old Trapper. When his farts have a proprietary blend that he can't <laughs> tell you. <laughs> little by little, the weakness will set in everywhere. This is how I feel when I vape in front of people that are under the age of 12. Just releasing a trail of sour apple into the ozone. <laughs> I'm just joking. I don't vape. I'm just making fake stuff up. Okay. I'm not cool. The only one with an antidote to their sickness will be me. Dude, she just got the ick right there. <laughs> that was the... Uh? Okay, but she's so camp. Very toby, I will love me. She looks like she could be working at a Mac counter 2015. She's giving. <gasps> Peony! Our house is dying. What'll happen to Peony? I'm sorry. I know how much she means to you. When you become homeless and your friend goes, I'm sorry, I know how much she means to you. I know it's kind of cramping your style. <laughs> it's killing your vibe, huh? I'm sorry, I know how much you loved food and shelter and basic living accommodations. No wonder I never wanted to leave the meadow. Uh, no, I'm not scared either. What if he was just telling her the directions? We should actually be heading 30 clicks north. <laughs> Right. What if he was saying, that this is mustard gas, we're walking into a, a, a dense <laughs> thicket of mustard gas. Like, yeah, Bibble. I'm not scared either. You're so cute, Bibble. <laughs> <gasps> We've got another prisoner. Which will it be? Marigold muffins or flower fluffer nutters? The fluffer nutters. Can we guess how he sounds? We're gonna guess what he sounds like. What? Uh, <laughs> well, I would never! Is it gluten-free? Whatever you're planning, the Enchantress will never let you get away with it. I was close. Mm. Oh, where are we now? The fact that she's not Google Mapsing this, Bibble this whole time is like, I have a map! You just won't listen to me! <laughs> That felt like a birth. Crowning. Also some womb vibes in here. Mm -hmm. Huh? I'm Alina and- I'm sorry, you need to leave. City Hall is closed. You know what, I was gonna say, how do they- how can they afford to keep him employed? But then he said City Hall, so he's a government worker, so psh. Damn. Taxpayer dollars are going towards this. Clearly nobody comes um, and in And look here. at him kicking his feet. He's probably just reading a book back there. He's reading A Court of Thorns and Roses as we speak. He's the ambassador of solitude. The ambassador of loneliness. I'm the ambassador of fairy smut. Hang on, Bibble. Ah! 
God, the movie was about to end. I like that her hair is just like 12 pieces. <laughs> it's like a snap-on Lego piece. Yeah, she went to the barber and just said, well, I like Legos. Come in, come in. Hop into my diva cup. <laughs> Be exhausted. Bibble got so excited. Dude, imagine showing this picture to an interior designer and going, all right, this is it. This. So let's do something like that. All right, see you next week. Um, aren't we waiting for the rest of your company? I'm sorry, but this is like a wipeout course for Barbie who does not have wings. Did you see the way she's balancing on that? This is the tenuous balance on the leaf. Somebody stop him. He's eating the Orbeez. That's his diet. That's going to cause a bowel obstruction. <laughs> We're giggling, but he has a serious sleep disorder. <laughs> Get Bibble a sleep study stack. Guys, CPAP for Bibble. Let's do a GoFundMe. <laughs> Imagine sleeping in that thing if you had like restless leg syndrome or something. Just like tearing through the pedals. Give me a seatbelt at least. Strap her in. I want you to hold something for me. She's gonna t pop off her Lego hairpiece. <laughs> Your necklace. And I want my necklace to stay safe. It's an air tag. I love the way she picked him up kind of like an iPad. Just. <laughs> I need a favor and you're the only puffball for the job. I need you to assassinate a high-profile fairy in a different kingdom. Bibble was like a highly decorated sniper. Oh my god. He Bibble, one, two, three, four, five purple, purple hearts. hearts! The war crimes he committed in the Great Fairy War. He's, he's a navy seal. He's a baby blue seal. Going somewhere, Azura? Fungus. <laughs> Okay, so she just got kidnapped. When the missionaries come to your door? <laughs> Going somewhere? Yeah. Hell. Get on oh, my back. I forgot about him. Oh, my Get on my back. <laughs> the wisp. Oh, the, the wisp. wisp. Is riding on this guy's back to safety worse than actually being kidnapped? What I'm more focused on is why is his clothing the same He's, color as his body? Is he naked? It just makes it seem like his skin is loose. We brought you a little something. Welcome, welcome. Join the party. This would be like finally being invited to the cool girl sleepover. Like, I know you guys are making fun of me the whole time, but I'm just glad I was invited. Where is your necklace? I rarely wear it. Blue clashes with my eyes. You lie! Actually, look at your beautiful eyes. Yeah, it just brings out the blue inside of your gray eyes. It actually brings out the luminescence of your wings, you filthy liar. You know what I say to myself on days like today? Prince no! Nothing to spoil a day like today. Hey! Hey, Flyboy! You have any idea how low you were zooming? Some of us were trying to... Oh, Hi. he was charmed Hold immediately. Hold on. Sorry if we disturbed you. No, no, not at all. I just, uh... I loved it. I'll uh, do it again, actually. Sorry, I didn't mean that there was a large butterfly swooping down. I meant that I was feeling butterflies in my tummy when I laid eyes upon such a gorgeous bride. What? I didn't see you coming up with any ideas. We Why does the butterfly up? have a zipper? Oh, no. What if he was just a guy? He's just a guy with some <laughs> face paint, electronic wing. He's taking this to a scaly convention next week. If you see this guy at Comic-Con, stay away from him. Eat that, all of you. Ugh, why? It's a special seaweed. It lets you breathe underwater. Please. What strain is that? Please, eat as much as you can. I love his Prince Nalu's subtle cat eye. 
they need to re-release this in those 4D theaters that ha that literally it's like you're in a uh, in like a little mini roller coaster and yeah, it sprays uh, water at you and stuff. They have a little robotic hand that'll grab your hand slowly so when Prince Nalu grabs Alina's hand. <laughs> It just crushes, you get crushing injuries. We need to get to the Wildering Wood. Uh, can you point us in the right direction? Oh my he's god, he's- no sense, he's naked He's outside. pantsless. Go back, go back. He's pantsless. I'm so perplexed. By the, I think that's the nose that makes it so strange. Whatever this is, it's dark-sided. It is. Girl, that's a booty hole. Be safe. I hope one day we'll meet again. Prince Nalu is gonna be journaling about this day for the next 20 years. Just etching it on the inside of the cave. Your diary. Today I met a baddie. I should come with you. Don't you get it? I won't let you come. I'm trying to take care of you. He's got a mozzarella stick wrapped around his neck. String cheese. Just a, a string cheese ready for a nibble at any moment. Hugh flew into the vape cloud and he's sick, so she's gonna go traverse this American Ninja Warrior course on her own. Can we check her system for PEDs? Yeah, there's no way she's not juicing. She's at least blood doping. That's not a natural athlete. Her vert? It's about drive, it's about power, we stay home. Do you know the Wildering Wood well? Do we know the Wildering Wood? <laughs> well, we live here, man, we certainly should. All I know is Lin-Manuel Miranda was involved in some way. My name's Alina, I have no wings, but I am definitely certain about figuring out some things. This is so bad. Don't use that. There's nothing here but a bunch of poor, sick trees. It's her life alert. Azura, I heard your necklace calling. She just postmated a fairy? A fairy guardian? All right, I get it. You want to come. I do too. Because, uh, you know, um, it's my... It's my job. What does he store in those zippers besides his nipples? Like, what what could he possibly be putting in there? Unrequited feelings for Alina? Mm. I'm doing it because it's my job. <laughs> not because I have a crush on you that I know I would never act on because, you know, we're not even the same. We're not even the same species. When you're Uber's but Alina. The entrance is right there. This is what it feels like when you're sleeping over at somebody's house and they don't give you a blanket. Ooh, you trying to find the bathroom, like walking through their house at night. You have to tuck your legs into your Aeropostle hoodie that you brought with you. You use the couch cushions as a little blanket. Yeah. This is fine. This is fine. I love this. I love sleepovers. Come on, get me if you can. You. What if they shoot him? With what? Dirty looks? A glare? These three tried to attack us outside the lair. We think that they're friends of the Wingless Fairy. Yeah, we you can't do. kidnap her. There's not enough chairs. What, you're gonna go to Ikea right now? Yeah. yeah. That's what you I thought. It's messing with your momentum. When you have to play musical chairs with your hostages. Show this fairy her future with me. <gasps> She's offering her wings! Yes! <gasps> wings! I would be like, sorry guys, yeah, it was nice knowing you. you. Being evil sounds like a good Actually, gig. The Benefits, the healthcare. I'll claim my birthright as ruler of Fairytopia, and you'll have the wings you deserve. Um, could we make them not, like, puke green? Could we maybe go yeah. for a less evil color? Your whole little world will be perfect! Oh... My whole little world! Honestly, oh. this would never be a problem for me because these necklace clasps are so hard to use. <laughs> Ten minutes she later... She has to keep redoing her speech. <laughs> oh! Sorry. I'll have everything I've ever wanted. Oh, you'll have everything you've ever- I'll, I'll have, have everything, everything I've ever wanted. Oh, I don't need your wings, Laverna. Her aim! Her athleticism is off the charts. She could be a weapon. Yeah. For the government. No wonder they didn't give her wings. Yeah. She'd be like a war drone. Wings! 
Thanks for watching. Let us know what other movies you want us to see. I'm thinking we do a Mermaidia next. That I don't sounds know. just me. Good. <laughs>